You know I love, uh... <laughs> just looking at chat, like, before the stream starts, and just seeing ski balls, squee ball, like, y'all. <laughs> oh god, apologies if my mic's a little weird. I'm trying to regulate the audio. I don't know what it was. Yes, like, uh, the other day's Minecraft stream kind of fucked me over, but... Th thank you. I'm... <laughs> I'm really glad you guys enjoy balls. I'm I'm glad we're all vibing. Uh <laughs> it's fucking Christ. Uh, yeah, um yeah, tonight we're playing Squee Balls. But Squee Balls Party for the Wii specifically, because there's a version for the DS, which I've seen no one review, and I've seen no- I've seen like one screenshot from it, and it looks like it's exactly like the Wii game, but for DS, and I'm assuming the graphics are worse? Garball Squee- never call me that again. <laughs> That's an awful string of words that aren't even real to assault my eyeballs. Thanks. <laughs> Anyways, uh, yeah, um, uh, <laughs> God. Little backstory for this game, uh, Squeeballs was a game that I played, like, with my cousins back when we were really little. Like, this was one of my cousin's only games that they had. So we used to play it a lot. I don't know what it was, just a combination of the character designs and the sounds and the Probably the graphics. I absolutely love the cinematics in this game. Ultimately, it's a minigame compilation, though. So there's nothing of depth here. You're only here to watch me. And maybe laugh at the funny guys. But the funny guys are only going to be funny for so long. I assure you that. I'm not reading that last chat out loud. Even though I really want to. I feel like it would haunt me in the years to come. But regardless of all that... Squeeballs. <laughs> oh, I'm. <laughs> nah, <laughs> fucking Christ. And in case any of my mods uh, see the chats, that that's my friend. That's my friend. Don't worry, he he's chill, arguably. <laughs> but yeah, uh, my my controller fell asleep. I just. I really hope that the audio... I forgot that the uh, Wii has background music, so I was wondering why my Elgato was freaking out. How badly- how bad is this gonna sound? Oh, that's so loud! Uh, 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 uh. That's really fucking loud in the capture, I apologize. Yeah, uh, <laughs> welcome to Squeeballs. I love video game. I just love seeing that whole green bar just fill up on, on OBS. Good God. Uh, for the record, the guy I bought my Wii from did not supply, uh, the protective jacket or the security strap. So, lack of better terms, I'm raw dogging this. Also, uh, if, if, the, if the game randomly crashes during the cinematic, don't worry about it. For whatever reason, uh, my game just doesn't want to load the cinematic. So let's see how far we get. This this is the story of the game. This is the story you get in the game kind of waiting for it to crash because it's crashed every time before but yeah Th this is your plot line this is your lord those are the squee balls there they are Th and these are showing all the different games we're gonna play tonight like you got like pumping up snorkel you got like as we've seen the bowling and the paint by numbers and it's crashing again are you crashing are you doing the thing yep there it goes you you only get you only get a taste if you if the whole cinematic is like a minute long, Squeebo got plot Squeelord, yeah, yeah. Uh, let me just 
Yeah, I gotta reset. I gotta reset. The game's fine. Like, this this disc works. But it's just the intro cinematic that it doesn't ever want to play. So, don't worry. Don't worry about that. But yeah, uh, the lore for Squeeballs is you are a toy- you are a tester visiting the, the Squeeball Island. What it is, is your company has sent you out here to test the Squeeballs. As you saw with the storefront, you're testing them to uh, see if they are going to be suitable enough to sell at stores, like in packages as toys. Because as everyone knows, kids can be really brutal with their toys. So why not take these sentient creatures and just beat them to death? Yeah, you, that's El Toro. You'll see him a lot. I don't know all these characters' names. Apparently you have to unlock the character names. Yeah, I don't know about those scarecrow guys. I literally know nothing about them. But yeah. Uh, this is a fresh save. I reset it. That's a bully. Uh, Fangs is in the background. That little yellow guy. I believe that's Octo he's chasing after. I forgot the fuzzball's name. Uh, that's another El Toro. It, uh, for whatever reason, the El Toros come in different colors. None of the other Squeeballs do, though. Yeah, we want to go for... Uh, I think party games, when you swap... Like, the controllers. Head-to-head -head game is when you play with another person. We want the challenge ladder. Oh, that's Sushi. That's Sushi. My bad. No, 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 no. That's Octo. The one in the little, uh... The preview image. That's Sushi. Oh, oh, the Squeakball testing belt. This is... This is arguably my least favorite game, but, like... Yeah, what all do we have unlocked from the start? We have, oh god, okay, we got 10 pin bowling. Oh, is it, oh, did it keep my save? I don't care, I'm going from the start, however. Which way is the more difficult one of these? Oh, oh, the bottom. Yeah, we have 10, I haven't, okay, I thought I erased my save file. Apparently I didn't. But, but still, we're going from the very start. We got 10 pin bowling, then cannon. Cooking is a nightmare. I'm gonna save cooking. Paint by squeeballs, shock, stampede, crazy lanes, feeding frenzy, pumping, squeeball golf, and squeeball testing belt. And apparently, there's more I haven't unlocked yet, so. But for the sake of it, we're just gonna go from the start with the first unlocked, which is 10 pin bowling. I love the little tutorial graphics. Yeah, like... Yeah, you use left and right on the control pad, which is strange, and B button lock in position. I think I need to actually be careful with how I'm set up, or else I'm going to smack the mic. Yeah, yeah. I from what I remember, I th I can't remember if it's like rotating it or actually spinning. Oh, yeah. Uh, the cinematics in this game. They're great. I love these. They they're very befitting of the time this game came out. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Again, I don't know exactly how I'm supposed to do that. Like, it's- this is just a warm-up thing. Okay, yeah, again. I'm not sure what it's trying to ask of me here. I still have eight balls, so... Okay, I got it now. I got it now. Okay. Why, look. 
Another head crab. Squeeballs, here we go. <laughs> Squeeballs. Oh, uh, I knew I forgot something. Give me half a second. Give me half a second. I knew I forgot to open up something. Where are you? Where is- I didn't put in the right file again. Whoops. Uh, here we go. Come on, you. I knew I forgot to open up something. That's on me. Yeah, uh, don't ask about the pumping. For your own sake, don't, don't ask about it. Yeah, Looney Tunes noises is accurate, but yeah. Yeah, it's... I don't know how I got bully in that, but... Yike. It's... It's fine, I just have to knock out four more. Wrong direction. Again, like, these control- like, the controls are good, they're just a little... finicky? At first? Hell yeah! Okay, I'll take that. But yeah, uh... Okay, 30 pins over with 8 throws. Okay, this is the same thing, but like... Oh, hell yeah! Let's go! Sick! Sushi, don't you dare move! Goodbye, sushi. <laughs> yeah, each squeeball has like a unique sound too. Oh! Ah, oh, you kidding me? It's fine. Keep in mind, these are just the first challenges. It gets worse. It gets worse. I go for all ten pins twice with four balls for successive spares. I it it the the, the wording the wording on some of these things. It gets confusing. Awesome. I think it wanted me to have two spares, however, though. I don't... Did that count? Oh, it did. Okay. Awesome. I just knocked down all of them with two. Okay. Oh! I didn't mean to hit next cha- Oh, we're in the cannon now. We're in the cannon now. Uh, this is the tennis game. I suck at this. This is not a fun one. Ah, hello, Gordon Freeman. It's good to see you. Uh, pineapple, blueberry tea. Oh, hello, bug. <laughs> hell yeah, hell yeah, me. I hate this. Here we go. I hate this. It's so fuck. Nah! I have to get- I have to hit all 20. Oh, I gotta get comfortable. I gotta get comfortable. Oh! Play again. Play again. Play again. Oh god! Oh god! 
god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. <laughs> well, this is one way to cheese it. <laughs> oh god, I got so loud there. I'm so sorry. Yeah, yeah, it's not good. <sighs> no, I'm back to 10 pin bowling. No, just why am I back here? I cover all the pins with one ball. Okay. Damn. It's fine. Come on, I could do I did this so much before. Oh, come on. I like how they just don't care that I got like f fucking four strikes already. <sighs> I like how Fangs is still standing, even though last time he was like barely tipped over. There we go. Okay, I need to see where we are on the challenge ladders because it fucked me up already. Oh my god, it's- okay, okay, okay. Square- square screen walls. The world. Yeah, it skipped me through. I didn't get screen balls on trick before. Okay, successive spares. Uh, splitting pins. Let's try this one. Uh... I don't remember how I did this last time. Whoops! I think what I did was I like came in from this direction and like I sliced into like those two. Damn it! Okay, but I know what I'm trying to- mm. You can kind of see what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get a good curve on it. Because again, I do th think I need to aim for- his name is Mau Mau, which is the green one. I for- Got the name of the little black dog. Oh. I think it's automatically trying to correct me to hit the top guy. I'm trying to hit Mau Mau and it keeps correcting me towards- Oh god, what is his name? I've learned all their names. Or you can just go after him, Jesus Christ. Ugh. Yeah, sometimes the physics are a little stupid, but again, I'm betting that's because this is- Come on! Are you kidding me? Ah. Uh. But you can see what I'm trying to do here. I'm skipping this. <laughs> I'm gonna try a few more times. I've already completed this. I've shown that I've already have because obviously this is my save file. Didn't clear itself like I thought it would. Oh, I am. <laughs> I'm like going through the strategies in my brain like this is a complex game or some shit. It, it's more complex than it probably should be though. You can see what I'm going for though. I'm trying to. I'm trying to smack them. No, too far! Fuck! Who? Man. Man indeed. Ah! I 
didn't even, I barely hit Mau Mau. Oh, I wish there was a way to like hard, like the quick reset, like a lot faster. One. <laughs> One. I've been doing this for like 20 minutes now, Jesus Christ. I can do it. I can do it. Shut up. Yeah! Okay. No, I don't want to go back to Cannon! Oh, I'll just smack him into the... Into the spot thing. Oh, no. Two. One. I don't- like, it, it's so particular on what side you're hitting him from. Huh. Bowling- bowling does that to the people. It keeps jumping me between challenges I've done and challenges I haven't done. Knock over the moving- what? Oh. Oh no. You bitch! <laughs> Gutter ball. I'm just gonna wait for it to bounce back and then... Maybe if... No! Fuck! Okay. Okay, go back, go back, go back, go back. Get him! Yeah! Huh. Pog. <laughs> Throw this ball around the moving TNT crate. What? What? The what? And the what now? Oh no. Fuck me, I guess. It's such a large target, too. No! Fuck! I had it! Get him, get him, get him! Hell yeah! You die. Yes, that's what happens when you hit TNT. Awkward bolt them to Oh, seven ten split, of course. Die, sushi. No, can your octo I always I don't know why I always confuse octo and sushi. Uh sushi is the fish and octo is the octopus. You can hear Fang- like, Fangs is the one with the high-pitched scream. Octo is the one that sounds like he's underwater. They're both fi- Wat- Water features. Oh, they're both fish. I got- I gotcha. Get him, get him, get him! Yeah! Let's go. Swerve strike. Throw the ball around the TNT crate to get strike. Oh, fuck me running. At least the TNT is not moving. Fuck 
you. Fuck you. Get him, get him, get him. Ah. I love games. I love being gamer. Why is the one in the middle? Why was it? Why did I get all the others and not the one in the dead center? I keep nicking the box too. I had to gamer moment. What? I had a gamer moment. Thanks. At least the game is responsive. It's not like the game is like broken or anything. It's actually quite responsive. And that's kind of why I'm a little angry. It's because I can't cheese it. It's a little too responsive of anything. Damn it. I'm switching over to another Kojo's game again. Gamer man. Game dose free game. What? I understand you're trying to make gamer memes about my name, but like Get him, get him, get No <laughs> Fuck you sushi and fuck you fangs. Come on, 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 fuck you. That was just a bad one. It's just fangs and bully. After I finish this, I'm swapping to another. I'm fin after I finish this challenge, I'm gonna swap to a different one. Like a different game. Cause I'm getting it. The cooking game? The cooking game? This early in? You don't understand my history with the cooking game. I've never properly, like, told people my history with the cooking game of Squeeballs. I hate you. I hate you, Fangs. <gasps> Finally. Finally. How bad is the challenge ladder looking? Christmas dinner. Knock three sets of pins over with three balls in a row. It's asking for a triple strike. I don't want to do any more cannon right now. Not cooking. Let's do paint by squeeballs. Let's do paint by squeeballs. Yeah. And squeeball by moving the pointer. Well, B and move the. Yeah, uh, for the longest time I didn't know how, like, I could move back. Because I, I thought I was moving back as far as I could. Also, this game does confirm that the squeeballs' blood. Is the color of their skin? Like... Oh, of course Bully is panicked that his friends are being fucking flung at him. Wow. Okay. I thought I would have 60 seconds to color in as much as I could, but okay. Three, two, one, go. The sounds they make 
are horrifying, by the way. If anyone thinks they're bad, yeah, yeah. They, I don't like how you, they get louder when they get closer to you. Treasy does it. I wait. I don't remember this one. No, don't tell me that this is like a later game one. Come on, man. Uh, no, no, check the challenge ladder because I don't remember. Okay, no, it was. Oh, wow. I just guess I don't remember Treasy does it. No, no, no. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. This is probably the easiest squeeball game, like once you get the hang of it. I forgot the snail guy's name. His scream is awful. I kind of deserve to do this to Fang, so. God. This is horrifying. This is just... The sounds these creatures make. No! Fang did nothing. Fuck you. Fang did everything. Color in at least 60% of the picture in 60 seconds and avoid hitting the water balloon. God. The sounds Bully makes are the worst. They're... I don't... I don't like how their eyes bulge. Like, if you pay attention whenever I pull it back, like... Like, it feels like I'm grabbing them by their faces. When I, like, when I'm doing this, and I don't know how I feel about that. Yeah, those are sounds. Yeah, yeah, they sure are sounds. What was that about capitalism? Fang started the squeeball capitalism. Absolutely. Absolutely. And yeah, they do sound terrified because they know what's about to happen to them. Because they know as long as I live on this island that they'll never know peace. They will never be free from the testing. Color in 6% of the picture in 45 seconds using 15 squeeballs. Okay. Why are you giving me so many sushis? Mau Mau is probably the most iconic sound. Stop giving me bad ones! No! Okay, the squeebles they give you are also completely random, so like... Gordos, you sound like GLaDOS. A little bit. Damn it! <laughs> I'm completely 
fine with sounding like GLaDOS during this, because that's all you're doing in this game. You're testing them. And if they can survive all these trials and tribulations, then they're good enough to be sold on store shelves for children to fucking destroy. God. There's, what is, there's no yellow anywhere? Fuck off, Fang. Okay. Yeah, such sound. <laughs> yellow on sushi. Oh, there was yellow on sushi. No, there's not. You could see sushi right there. There's no yellow on sushi. Oh, wait, no, you're right. Sushi's fin. My bad. Now I have to clean Mau Mau. I, I see the fins. I'm sorry. Nope. No! Fuck me running, I guess. Ah! I might be a little blind. Don't need to be mean. Don't be mean to me while I'm... You're fine, Mau Mau. You're fine, Mau Mau. It's normal, Mau Mau. There you go. Don't be mean to me while I'm squeeballing. Colored only 60% of the picture with 30 squeeballs in 75 seconds. I'm gonna die. So give me so many sushis! I mean, Octos, I don't know why I keep confusing the two. They're just- I, again, I think they're- it's just because they're ocean creatures. Who? Stupid head crab, I'm fucking ballin'. Huh. 95% of the picture in 60 seconds? I'm just rapid firing this bitch.
Got him. Fuck yeah, go off. <laughs> Puppy. Yeah, I don't- Like, uh, when you- The more you play the game, you actually unlock their names. Uh, color in six picture in six seconds and knock the white balloons away before they pop. Two, one, go. Damn it. There we go. Pop the paint balloons to color in 50% of the picture in 60 seconds. Okay. No! Hit one of the balloons! Please. I've lost so much time already. There we go. We should make Squeewallow C's. Oh, that sounds awful, but I'm into it. I would You 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 know what? Let's finish up the paint by squeak balls and then I'll show you the cooking challenge because we've been going for, um, I think we'll be going for about an hour by then. 50% of Kraboom, that's his name, uh, using the paint filled balloons in 30 seconds. Come on. Come on. Come on. Damn it. Give me a fang. Damn it. Terrible idea. Let's do it. Hell yeah. I'm glad that we all agree that this is an awful idea and we're all just. It, it sounds like fun. That one. I like that one the least. Oh, 70% of the picture in 90 seconds. Let's go. I love the little tips are just telling me it's like make sure to fill in the correct colors. They're very helpful. Oh, my God. 
There we go. <laughs> 69, nice, thanks. I love the sound the blue doggy makes when he is thrown. That is bully and it's great. Oh, here we go. We're done with the... <laughs> We're done with, uh... Oh, wait, uh, let's see. Character bio. I have someone unlocked. <gasps> oh, did I reset this? I thought I- yeah, okay, okay, we have Fangs. Uh, Fangs is a fire cracker of a character and looks and personality. Wilder than a bag full of weasels, Fangs will quite happily let you stroke it when it's asleep. Stubby. Stubby is a toy dog and is the polar opposite to Bully. Th this one is quiet and not so likely to bite the postman. It has always been one of the most- po the more popular Squeebells toys. So Stubby. We got stubby and we got bully. Oh, I gotta sit up in a pacifist mode. How do I do a pacifist mode? How do I do that in Squeeballs? You, I, you wanted to see cooking. How, I don't, I can't do a pacifist mode. Oh my God. Uh, what game is the most pacifist? Uh, let me see here. Here we Squeeballs. I guess shock? Because I'm trying to keep the squeeballs. No. No, no, no. Uh, there has to be like a 30 second one. Okay, shock, I could at least like wait it out to 30 seconds. It was the, re the Wii remote point. Yeah, yeah. The whole point of the shock is to do that whole uh, electrified magnet maze, you know? The one where you have to drag the metal through it without getting shocked, because yeah. You don't have to. Torture mode, don't fuck up. Basically, if I just failed this one, I would have, like, succeeded in the pacifist challenge. Stubby. Bully. <laughs> Bully so mean. Yeah, even the squeeballs fuck around with each other sometimes. Yeah, bu bully's an ass. Come on. I think that one's name was Snorgel. Shock three squeeze balls in 20 seconds by hovering the loop over each spark. See? Stubby lived. The three guys watching him, waiting for him to die, didn't it, though? Gordon, you just killed him yet. It's fine. It's fine. They're not men, they're squeeballs. Loop the loop to the end of the wire without losing all charge in 20 seconds. No, 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 no. No, shut up. Okay, okay. Some of these do get kind of dumb because I don't have Wii Motion Plus. Wait, no, it just automatically loops. My bad. Yeah, I believe that that guy's name, like the yellow looking dog thing, I think that's Artie. They're not dead, they're sleeping. Yeah, I just, I just burned them horrifically beyond the point of recognition. They're still fine, though. I reached the end of the wire without losing all the charge. Avoid the water spray. Goodbye, sushi. <laughs> oh, yeah, 
Yeah, they just sent them the Dairy Queen. Yeah, yeah, exactly. I don't remember the snail guy's name, though. Chuck four squeeballs in 30 seconds by hovering the loop over each spark. Oh, this is the one I did not like. No, oh, fuck you. You live for now, you weird snail creature. Yeah, we are just sending- yeah, EBDB. They got sent to EBDB. Didn't EBDB get, like, a uh, top on, like, Tumblr or whatever this year? I vaguely remember someone mentioning EBDB last night when they were looking at, like, the Tumblr year in review or whatever it is. Yeah, yeah, EBDB. Move the loop to the end of the wire without losing all its charge in 25 seconds. I'm not yelling too much, so I'm turning back up my microphone volume a little bit. That's 23? Oh, 37, my bad. Why did I say 23? <laughs> oh, God, look at this. Nightmare. Yeah, it, that is some shapes. Thankfully, uh, I forgot that this game, it automatically turns it, You so you just have to worry about tracing the line. Oh god, I hate this one. I hate this one! Look at this! God, I hate the water ones. The ones where there's just like a lot of water and I'm just panicked the whole time. Cardinal skill man. Thank you. Shock four squeeballs in 40 seconds by hovering. Oh, oh no. Is it this one? It's this one. No, fuck you, bully. Fuck you, bully. Oh, these ones always freak me out. No, let me grab it. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you, s Dubs. Stubby? I think his name is Stubby. Stop it. Shut up, shut up, shut up, don't laugh at me. I'm so nervous on this one, I hate this one. Okay, that was just a bad one. I'm gonna wait until they're actually mid pumping water to start moving. No! 
Fuck you. Fuck you. Thank you, bug. I didn't know I didn't have to hold. This whole time I thought I had to hold it over the sparks. I just had to run it over. No! No! Fuck you! It's always that curve. It's always that last one. Ugh. Wait for it. No! Oh. Okay. So hello, Rai. Wow. Okay. Fuck you, Artie. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. No! Fuck you, fuck you, fuck. Okay. know that brown guy's name. I've never learned his name and I don't like him. Oh, I'm, I'm trying to go too fast. Yeah, just fight him. Gotcha. Huh. Hate that one. Hate that one. Awful. Shock five squeak balls in 50 seconds by hovering the loop over each spark. Okay. Wow, that was not a good start. First try. Fuck you. Huh. I hated that I fucked up so early and that I could only hear the warning sirens. I need a drink. Oh. Hello, Kyrie. Uh, okay. Okay. I grabbed a paper towel just to wipe my hands off because I always get so sweaty when I try to pl I get really sweaty and clammy when I try to play games like this. Huh. With the loop to the end of the wire without touching it in 25 seconds. Oh lordy. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, I went a little too fast. I went a little too fast. Fuck 
Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Oh, fuck you, bully. Fuck you, bully. Fuck you, fuck you. Huh. Upside, I can smell my mom making dinner. Hell yeah. Uh, troughs and peaks pick shock six squeeze balls in 45 seconds by hovering over. <laughs> no! Fuck yeah! Let's go! Let's fucking go! Oh. Glute to the end of the way without touching it. What? What? Hello? Oh. Oh my god, it's an auto scroller! Oh my god, it's an auto scroller. Oh my god, I hate this. Oh my god, why would you put an auto scroller in this? Oh my god. At least I'm close to the end. Oh, I hate this. Whose bright idea was this? Look at all those fucking squeeballs in the back. Oh, God. Die. <laughs> it's- I don't like it. It's too stressful. That- please tell me that was the last- No, it's not. Keep the loop on the screen and don't lose all the charge. Oh god. I didn't think it could get worse. But it got worse. We say no no this time. Who am I gonna shock to death? Oh, the weird- the weird fuzzy brown dude, okay. Another one. Violence, yes. <gasps> yeah! New character bio unlocked! I got- who's Boris? Who in God's name is Boris? Is that the- is that the brown ball dude? Is that Boris? No, Boris is the slug. Okay, okay. That's one of two I don't know. Boris is without doubt the slowest of the squeeballs range in a straight race. Being the the best behaved more than makes up for this, and it has proved a firm favorite. Possibly the cuddliest slug you'll ever come across. Okay. Okay, Boris, you live for now. I did not. Squashes him to death, half jo- What do you mean half joking? Uh, okay, Boris, I I'm fine with Boris. Boris has interesting sounds at least. Okay. I think I got a good enough- You guys- You guys wanna see cooking? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? You guys wanna see cooking? You wanna see the hell? 
We've been going for about a, a little over an hour. I'd much rather... Let's get the pain of cooking out of the way now. Cooking is... Yeah, 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 yeah. I've mentioned this before, that this is a rite of passage for me and my cousins. Like, tr getting... Like, if people want to, like, play games with us, or people want to be a part of our family, they have to clear the cooking minigame, or at least bear witness to it. So we're going to ah, play the cooking hello, minigame. hello, Gordon Freeman. It's good to see you. Oh, hell yeah. Thanks... <laughs> Thanks, Ted. May given that sub out to Ray. Look at them. They're suffering. That's El Toro, and he just devoured Mau Mau. Which is funny, because if you, uh, if the intro cinematic didn't cut out, you would be able to tell that El Toros are sold along the other squeeballs, so. Yeah. They can grill two sausages for El Toro. Okay. <sighs> Let's get this over with eating him. Yes, hello, Katie. I'm glad you're here, too. Let's go. I'm just gonna speedrun these because I love because I always speedrun the cooking mini game. Ah, hello, Gordon Freeman. It's good to see you. Oh. <laughs> Thank you again <laughs> to Edme. Give it out subs. Damn, man. Vegetable soup, carrots, and onions make this recipe for El Toro to enjoy. I think this is the only one recipe that, like, one of the few recipes that doesn't call for like a squeeball being murdered. <laughs> Cooking mama, eat your fucking heart out. Squeebells has become vegan for now. Making grilled two hot dogs for El Toro using a using bully instead of stubs. Is it stubs or stubby? Did I The noises get worse? I, every time I think I'm doing good at this game, I, it's always like when I'm at three recipes in, there's like ten recipes. Squeeballs, if they consent, would be considered vegan. What the fuck? No. It's still meat. <gasps> Pancake. I. L <laughs> this one just has one of my favorite frame, like one of my favorite like little animations for any game. Just, just, just watch. Just watch. It's great. It's just flattened. That's the whole recipe! <laughs> I just flattened a fang and fried it up and handed it to El Toro. Cook an arty casserole to satisfy El Toro's appetite. I think this one requires a lot of arties. Yeah, and then just a whole ass arty. This is one of the fucked up steps. Is disposing of the corpse. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I love seeing chat catch up and then <laughs> it's the 
bones. <laughs> Just the bones. They're posing on the <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> when squeeballs- Okay, okay, squeeballs. Uh, the way they're cooked is their eyes are part of their skeleton. So, like, you can cook off all their flesh and all that and just pull out the skeleton because their brains and their- I think their brains are in their eyes or whatever because as long as the eyes are intact, the squeeball is still alive. It's horrifying. I don't like this. No one likes this. It's not good. It's not fun. <laughs> Fry Mau Mau and season to taste for a delicious fried treat. Come here, Mau Mau. Get in there. This is the most stereotypical evil person cooking ever. I'm just feeding him a whole Mau Mau. I feel like a witch in like a little hut. <laughs> I forgot about that recipe. I forgot about that recipe. <laughs> Why do you... <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Squeeballs, my friends! Fried little meow meow. <laughs> Try and mince up five st Okay, it's stubby. Okay, five stubbies for a plate of sausages before El Toro gets hungry. This is one of the annoying recipes. Because you have to make the sausage and you gotta cut it up and you gotta fry it. Just... Oh, wait, no, 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 I'm thinking of a later one. There's like a later recipe where you have to make like 10 of these. There you go, El Toro. They're raw. <laughs> I have five raw stubby sausages. A simple onion omelet. Okay. Come here, fangs. Become flattened. Who puts salt in a pancake? Well, it's an onion pancake. I don't know what I'm expecting. I think it's kind of like a potato pancake. I think I might make pan I'm, I'm craving potato pancakes. I might make those sometime this week. It's been a while. Appar I didn't even know that potato pancakes are like, uh, a, a, like a traditionally Jewish cuisine, which I think might be fitting for Hanukkah. It's not even an omelet, it's just, it's just a squeeball with onion on it. Yeah, that is. An un- <laughs> seafood soup, but octo and sushi delicacy. Three, two, one, go. Goodbye, sushi. God, there's so many sushis. I like going fast enough that you guys can't even register what's on screen until it's already gone. Now where's sushi? There's sushi, get in there. Oh, you can hear him drowning, which is kind of fucked up considering he's a sea creature. Yeah. Oh, the I'm not too. Oh, I love chat. I love chat so much. You guys are going off. <laughs> oh, oh, this is the sausage recipe. I'm getting better. My arm's not hurting like the last time I played this. But it might just be because I haven't encountered this recipe yet. You have to be on your shit or else El Toro will actually eat you. I have to focus or else I'll be eaten by the devil. Do you like the sounds of stubbies? 
I don't. <laughs> oh god, my arm. Ow. Uh, 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 it's not f It's always that one that takes it out of me. Uh. Oh, the crying game. Chop 20 onions and season and serve for classic French onion soup. I never knew that this challenge specifically was called the crying game, but I feel that. Uh. This one, ha as you can see, there's a lot of steps, but it's like the same basic motions, and this one just requires wrist instead of your whole shoulder. I would kill to see a squee balls speed run. I think it'd be really funny if someone else, like, could find exploits for Squeeball's party for the Wii. A squeed run! Yes! I wanna watch a I wanna watch a squeed run! I wanna be a squeed runner! Oh god, I'm looking at chat and I'm seeing everyone condemning Ray and honestly y'all are right. Get his ass. Crunchy ceramic, yeah, yeah, he has to eat the bowl. Five screwball pancakes. Come here, Fangs. Also, I fucking love how low like how low quality and eerie this whole room is. The fact that this is probably El Toro's house. And that he's the only Squeeball that canonically has a place that's all his. Just a bunch of. I also, his. His little, his little food mat there. It's just the Squeeballs logo. Uh, let's look at chat. Uh, pancake day. Oh, uh, when I look at the two anime pancakes. Oh, it's still low, low res in here. It's it's so fucking weird. It's a place that, that's all he's yet still sold alongside the other Squeeballs. Yeah, yeah. It's like, it's not, and I'm not even sure if it's canon that this is, I'm not even sure if it's canon that this is his home, or this is a home that was built by the corporation trying to test out Squeeballs. How much you want to bet that they feed the El Toros, and then they package them? They can't test the El Toros because they're too big. This is a complicated menu with several ingredients, but it's sure to fill El Toro up. How many, yeah, look at this room. It's, it, it's a lot. I think this is the last recipe. Drown! Drown, you dumb fish! I never- I've yet to find the correct way to like, do the salt. I like how we, there's two dead squee balls in there. 
How strong is that grater to go through bone? <laughs> Clearly you've never grated a carrot. Fair enough. Fair enough. Also, yeah, gr graters can also cut your own skin, so I, I wouldn't doubt it if they had, like, a special grater just for squeak balls. How much you want to bet that they probably also sell squeak balls as ingredients? Strong arm is needed to make this recipe in time for El Toro's patience not to run out. Let's go, gamers! Go, 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 go! Drown Snorgle! Drown the Snorgle! How many snorkels are in here? How many snorkels can one man eat? Jesus Christ! Stir, motherfucker, stir! Oh my god, El Toro! Done! Ugh! Oh, there's so much pepper in that soup. There's so much salt, pepper, snorgles. There's a lot of snorgle. This is a snorgle heavy meal. I. No, as far as I'm aware, no one even knows that this game still exists. I'm gonna- I really would love to just commission someone to just get me all the models off of Squeebell's party. I have multiple copies of the game. I have another copy arriving in the mail that has like, uh, like the manual and the actual full box art. Cause I just got this as a loose copy off eBay. Like, I would happily pay someone to data mine all of Squeebell's and just get me all the models. Oh, no more cooking, hell yeah. No more cooking. Which one were we over here? Uh, four, 25, 20. Yeah, we finished shock, didn't we? Yeah. <gasps> Crazy lanes. This is bowling, but better. Mm, soup user died to El Toro. Okay, there is like the 10 pin bowling, which we were playing, but Crazy Lanes is better. With the pointer on the screen and press and hold the B button. Hold back the. Instead of just letting the ball go, you actually you are actively controlling it the whole time. It's a platform. This is a bowling platform game. Oh no, uh, ten pin bowling is closer to Wii bowling. This is a bowling platformer. Stubbs, you led your friend down there. Okay. Yeah. Instead of, like, swinging your arm, you're pulling it back like you would in the, uh, Paint by Squeakballs game.
Damn. Mario Kart, but it's bowling and squeeze-balls fucked up super monkey ball. <laughs> oh god, I would love to pl I would love to see a squeeze-ball super monkey ball. Come on, you. Oh, it's because my, my pointer is in the red. I would absolutely kill to see a squeeze-ball super monkey ball crossover, though. I was seriously considering getting a Super Monkey Ball game. Like, because I know that they released a couple on the Switch. And, like, one of them looks promising. The other one, I've heard nothing but bad things. Squeeper, oh man. God. Let's just all make O instead of making just like uh, squeeballs OCs, let's make like squeeball t like tester OCs. Like, because canonically you are playing as a human that's like testing the squeeballs to see if your company can sell them, so. I, I want to design a uniform for like squeeballs workers, you know? Fucked up an evil retail employee ass motherfuckers. Yeah. Like, technically you're just, like, your character would just be, like, uh, not even, like, retail customer. Like, you would just be, uh, like, your character would just be, like, one of the low-paid workers that's just sent out here to experiment on these poor things. Like, your character could be all for the testing, or it could be completely against. Like, that- I think that'd be interesting. Again, I've mentioned this, like, over the years. Squeeballs has a lot of very promising things, and I'm very upset that they only ever got, like, the Wii game and, like, the DS port. Because th there's a lot of promise here. This is a very fun minigame compilation. Obviously, I would like to see this, like, fleshed down to a proper board game thing like Mario Party or something, but... It has a lot of promise. Oh god, too high, too high! I go. I don't even know how I managed that one last time. I just really like uh, aiming the ball like this and staying off the high roads because it's just like PvP. You are <laughs> bowling ball. Could you imagine a bowling ball a bowling ball ASMR though? Like it's just the sound of like the pins clattering, but they're like extra loud, so 
Damn it. <laughs> POV, your ball. I would 100% just make a Squee Balls fan game. That's just like modding Mario Party to have Squee Balls games. Because I would love to see like this game in like a four player scenario where like everyone's got their balls and they're trying to like get to the end and knock down all the pins they can. That would be fucking fun. Katie adds Squeeballs the snip snip snippy. Is a background game one of the characters likes? I still need to stream snip snip the snip snip snippy demo. <laughs> go Katie, go. I believe in you. I I've done more insane things for less funny memes, so... Oh, awesome. Dinner's done. Uh, give me like half a second. I gotta text my mom back. Oh, you, yeah, yeah, you had to get a spare on that one. So you can pass it around all <laughs> that's we doing is spares. Knock over 30 pins and click 20 stars with 8 balls. Watch out for the TNT crates. Oh, it's one of these levels. Look, Gordon, explosives. Thank you. Oh, come on. Okay, one more ball. I just like the sound the stars make when I collect them at this point. Could you just imagine seeing this ball come at you out of nowhere? Oh, awesome! Okay, one more. POV, you're a squee ball and this ball is coming at you. What do you do? Bowl the ball down the lane in under 15 seconds and knock at least three pins over. No, too high, too high! 
Oh, one second. Yeah? I was gonna go over here and grab that because that seems to be the new one out. Thank you. My mother has brought me food. <laughs> I have been given dinner. Star sounds very good. Also, congrats on not exploding. Thank you. Hell yeah. I'll not go for all ten pins two times in a row. Or two balls four times in a row. What? Come here, Stubby. Hell yeah. Oh god, different terrain. Oh no. Oh no. Damn it. I'm gonna eat a little bit of my dinner. I'm very hungry. I hope everyone else has eaten already. My friend's in the EST time zone. It's almost 8 o'clock. Awesome, good to hear. Smart. Ah, damn it. <laughs> a hydrate. I just took a drink, but I'll take another one. Get it over with. Come on, that was a bad first pitch and it noticed it. Oh. 
Come on, you. Come on, you. Awesome. Okay, okay. Drink, drink, drink. <laughs> Hydration is important. I hope everyone else in chat has been hydrating tonight. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. I'm going for sushi. I own. I was hoping I could have gotten actually a spin on sushi, but I was wrong. Lost control at the end there. I think my best strategy is just to aim for uh, five of them each time. Here we go. What am I missing in chat? So we have root beer, Mountain Dew, orange soda, nice. Milk and Oreos is good, man. Milk and Oreos counts as drink. Damn it. I was hoping there'd be a way I could like pause the game, but I can't seem to find one. Oh. Oh. Not faster, it's less annoying, but it's not much faster. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Oh. 
I don't know why my... I just had a random thought that just culminated itself in thinking, what if I just made a squee balls ARG? Oh no. Like, could you imagine just, like, an ARG for an obscure Wii party game? Oh god, oh god, coming in a little fast! Hell yeah, strike! Okay, okay, okay. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. We're getting there. Come on. Maybe? Maybe? Maybe. Maybe. Just maybe. <laughs> no! Fuck you, Artie! Fucked up. It's so fucked up. Wow. Wow. Okay, I was trying to do a curveball, but that works too. Thanks. Okay, but like if I fail this next attempt, I'll just switch over to another game for a little bit. Because I think my, like, you know when your brain just keeps doing the same thing? Like, you're, like you just keep doing the same thing and your brain just can't differentiate anything anymore? I think I'm getting to that point, so if I fuck up on this next one, then like, I'll just, uh... Load up a different game. I'll, I'll probably Rampage or Stampede. Those are the same exact game, but with different premises. One's a lot trickier than the other. Yep, 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 yep. Tabbing out, tabbing out. I'm gonna play a different game for a little bit. Let's do pumping. Yeah. In 
plate snorkel. Oh. Oh, I didn't plug my computer in. Whoops. My computer came off its charger. There we go. That should be fine now. Pumping. Inflate snorkel. I move the remote up and down. <laughs> oh. And he's dead. Inflate snorkel to at least twice the size without popping it in the time limit. Three, two, one, go. Oh, what? Okay. That wasn't anything, but okay. Pop snorkel. <laughs> Why there's so many places with lava pools? I don't know. I have yet to get that deep in the squeeballs lore. I assume the red thing that popped out of him was his heart. This is your new hell. He explodes into white. I was sitting here like, wasn't there a squeeball that exploded into white? And it's Snorgle. Yes. Yes. Three, two, it's awful. One. Two. Three. Die. <laughs> Blade snorkel enough to guide it through two metal rings and spot it into the black, yellow, blue. Just hit the target. Two, one, no, fuck. Went a little, got a little, got a little trigger happy. Three, two, one, oh, that's not enough. Maybe it's- oh, never mind. Snorgel continues to amaze me. <laughs> it's played Snorgel enough that it yelps and is ready to burst, but don't pop it. The wording. Plate snorkel enough to guide it through three of the four metal rings and spot in the. Okay. This is the most mini game ever. You're absolutely correct. I'm deleting my computer. Fair enough. No. <laughs> so many kids do you think got a new from this game? <laughs> what do you think? No. No. <laughs> Fucked up. Oh. We have to kill him. We have to kill them all. I'm so fucking focused!
Ah, oh, my wrists! Ow! That hurt. I'll get my computer up to leading society. I don't think society was affected by the release of squee balls ex outside of myself and my cousins. Phoenix from the ashes and played snorkel after the guy threw at least four middle rings and splatted in the. counts. Thank you, Snorgel. Oh, they do call it splatting. Gotta do a big white splat. Oh. Fly. I was glad that you're also affected by this game now. Fly Snorgel through five rings, collect four stars, and splat on the target. Oh no. I can get the stars. No. No. Oh. Never mind, Snorkel, you lit you get to die. Hell yeah. Thankfully, Snorkel didn't have to suffer for long. I love telling my practice to split on the <laughs> Katie! Katie! Katie, thank you. Thank you for reading. For making me read that. Holy shit. Holy shit. Damn, it has been two hours. Oh, my legs. I gotta stretch it out. Ow. Ray, Ray. God. Okay. Okay. <laughs> what is snorkeling? I don't want to know. I don't want to know. I'm just, I'm going to we're going to do squee ball testing belt. This is the one I don't like. Like the other ones are tricky and a little annoying. This one I just don't it it goes too fast. Squee ball testing belt. Yep, you just have to mimic what it's showing you. <laughs> I love them using Artie for that last one. Hi, 
Goodbye, Artie. Goodbye, Artie. No! No! <laughs> they killed Artie! You're fucking dead! <laughs> Punch five bullies by moving the Wii Remote, re the Wii remote forwards. Wow. Two, one, go. Da -da -da -da. Oh oh. God, I hate the little sounds. Bully and Sushi are now in the conveyor. Hit ten of them correctly. Use a right or left, a right to left gesture for Sushi. Two, one, go. This one's like a, a music game. Fangs has been added to Bully and Sushi. Hit 15 of them correctly. Use a left to right gesture for Fangs. I don't know why I that thing didn't trigger for fangs. <laughs> DDR but violent implying DDR isn't inherently violent. DDR could be violent if you really tried. Use a downwards gesture for Oh Mau Mau's here. Just the Mau Mau's. Just bonk. 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 Octo Crushy. Octo has joined the conveyor with the other squeeballs on the conveyor. Uh, use an upwards gesture for Octo. Okay. <laughs> you flat no talent. <laughs> oh, I love him. Yeah, Mau Mau just gets bopped. Like, out of all of them, Mau Mau is like the least injured. Just. Uh, uh, fucking Octo just gets flattened. <laughs> Cats can. Cats cannot be harmed. All they can be is boot. Boofed. I like bonked. It's just the bonked meme with the dogs, but it's just two Mau Maus. Oh yeah, the sound effects in this game are great. I think the little squeaks in a victory they have is like a little uncomfortable, but like
Okay, I only go after Octo and Sushi. Okay. I don't know why it gave me a fail. I didn't see- Did an Octo get by? Or like a sushi I meant? Sorry. Oh, oh, oh. Look at the how fast that's blinking. It's gonna get faster. Uh oh indeed. Yeah. Going 15, okay. Oh! Okay, okay. Only prefer the actions on Bully, Fangs, and Mau Mau. Okay. Bully, Fangs, Mau Mau. Bully, Fangs, Mau Mau. Hell yeah. Okay. I'm doing better than I did last time. <sighs> oh no. Don't hit Kraboom. They added Kraboom. Mm-hmm. 40 of them. I like Crap Boom. I think he's got an interesting design, but I feel like since there's one little evil dude, there should have been two little evil dudes. Because then we would have had three little- then we would have three, like, three evil dudes. Because we have El Toro and we have Crap Boom. But we don't have a third one. I feel like a lot of- like, comedy comes in threes. We kind of need a third. Don't call him a crab boomer. No, Edme. So it making. <laughs> A squeeble. Okay, let's go. Oh, oh, oh. 
my boom disables me. Oh my god, he's dis he disables me. When they say don't hit Kraboom, they mean it. Bonk! Okay. He explodes her arms. Yeah, I mean, I understand it. Like, how would you feel if, like, a bomb just went off in your face? I feel like you'd also be disoriented for a few seconds. Let's go! Yo! Oh. Octo, sushi, and bully. Sound like a very weird sin song. A little bit, yeah. <laughs> Gordon, I think you'd normally be dead from a bomb in your face. You know what I mean. Like, I don't know about you, I think I'd su- I <laughs> I'm built different. I think I'd survive. <laughs> okay, Octo, Sushi, and Bully. Gotcha. you Come on, come on, I'm making this. I'm doing it. What? What? What am I doing wrong? Yeah. I'm gonna try one more time. Okay, that's time I'll let it have it because I didn't. What? Why does it say I had two wrong? What? 
No, quit. You're fucking broken. And that's like the last... Yeah, it's reading Fang a sushi. Like, I don't know. Watch me try to figure out how to set up a task. I, I love how you people redeem these things immediately after I took a sip. But thank you for, like, checking in. I appreciate that. Let's do more 10 pin bowling. Knock three sets of pins over with three balls in a row. Okay, they're just asking for three strikes. Let's try. Damn. At least they're only asking for three strikes. They're not asking for much. They're not asking for anything wild. Yeah, they got normal building. Like, they got, uh, it looks like for most of the games they have two versions of each. At least that's what kind of feels like. Fuck you, stubby. I'm trying to find a sweet spot. <sighs> Come on. I 
I would kill if they had a second cooking game on here, though. I don't like this game. <laughs> I've been going for two and a half hours. What the shit? Is there anything else I can play? Let's see. Uh, let's try Stampede. In this game, you just throw crabooms. Stampede. Squeeballs run towards you. Showing their love. Ah. Point. He's pointing the point at the squeeballs and press B button to fire. <laughs> Goodbye, Artie. Yeah, no love. Well, you'll find out very quickly why you don't want an army of squeeballs loving you. No love for the monster that you are. <laughs> yeah. I just have to get one environmental kill. There we go. Survive for 30 seconds without the squeeballs smothering you with their love. That's what happens. The squeeball jumps on your face. Yeah, yeah, they're quite literally. Like having one or two squeeballs love you, that's one thing.
head crabs with their squee balls. <laughs> Awful. Could you imagine like having a crab boom on your head like a head crab? Damn. Head balls. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, now we just have to earn points. I'm just bullshitting this. <laughs> Good news, I found a whopping 15 minute tutorial on how to get models from Wii games. Bad news, I can only find legal squeeballs ROMs in the DS version. Damn it. I'll, I'll just- <laughs> I'm gonna find someone that I can just commission to rip a Wii- like the models for me and I will give them my copy of squeeballs. Like, just to make the ROM. Twenty-five Krabooms. Okay, now it's telling me to be smart. Come on, come on, come on! Two, one, hell yeah!
Okay, score 50,000 points with 10 kills from Icicles and 10 kills from Snowman. Hell yeah. So many mouth. <laughs> yeah. It, it. Oh damn, twenty four six hit the screen, okay. Damn it. Damn it. Try again. Wow, I'm bad at this one. <laughs> Killing and living and smothering and hugging. Ugh. Shout out to that one texture that just didn't load right. Hell yeah, okay. <laughs> 30 before 4! I want death!
Okay, I can live with that. Score a thousand point. <sighs> Two, one, go. I... No, fuck you, I was there, I was there. No! I'm just getting angry now. attempt.
Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. At least music is better. The music's nice, but at what cost? Tender, loving, scared. Don't let any screwballs show its affection for 90 seconds. It's a no hit run. It's a no hit run. Anguish. Ugh. Hell. Hell. Hell is real. Hell is real. Okay. It's a no hit run for a minute and a half. You. Fuck you! Fuck you! I can't. I know. I need. <sighs> I'm doing PD frenzy. It's just like that. It's just like Stampede. But I get revenge. POV, you are a Boris. Three, two, one, go. Where did his legs go? Boris never had legs. Or in El Toro didn't have legs ever either. Yeah, no, El Toro never had legs. He never had them. What? Okay, if you found any, like, concept art, like, hit me up, because honestly, I haven't found any. No. I, oh. Oh, you are right. He did have, I thought. Huh. I'll finish this mini game and then reload it because I want to double check now. No, like, you're right. Even in the little thing, he had legs. What? It's really weird. Might have just been a concept they started off but like got rid of because he for whatever reason. That's very strange. Like yeah, you could even
I guess they removed his legs just so he would be less scary. That, okay, okay, I'll just question to the chat. Is El Toro is El Toro scarier without his legs or with his little legs in the uh in the art in the corner? Oh no! Goodbye. Fun fact, that's the same animation that plays if you fail the cooking game. Without them, he looks like he's moving by sheer force of will. That's horrifying. You, oh, <laughs> Bug just doesn't find El Toro scary. He just wants to stomp him to death. Jesus. Yo, yo, I fed you, fuck you! He, he does look very softable, you're right. I feel like- I feel like El Toro would be like one of those insect species that like you hear about that like you see about it in the news, and it's just like, if you see this, and you click on the link, it's like, if you see this bug, kill it immediately. Three, two, one, go. Oh god, 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 oh god. How did I live? How did I live? How did I survive? What the fuck? <laughs> Three, two, one, go. 
Fuck you. Fuck you. I hate this. I hate this. It's awful. Psychological horror game. No, no, I fed you! I fed you! <sighs> I hate this. I hate this. No! This guy- what? No. 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 What? I clear feeding the herd. Did I just not get the right percentile? Oh my god. <coughs> Someone pay attention to my percentage. Tell me if I'm doing it right. Has to be above 60, yeah, yeah. I'm getting angry because I keep thinking I'm hitting above 60 though. so much tension in my body. So how are we all vibing? I'm not vibing.
a 63! Anguish, turmoil, trying one more time. I'm getting stressed. I'm trying one more time. I'm getting so fucking stressed. I'm getting stressed, I'm getting stressed, I'm closing out of that game. Uh, I'm getting stressed. I, I, I think I skipped ahead in Crazy Lanes. Whoopsie. I think I skipped forward to where I was in the game. Oh, wait. Uh. Did that. Yeah, ten pins with two balls, four times in a row. I think we're at straight crazy. Oh, uh, I'm at least taking a break from that game. I'm at least taking a break from that game. Uh, I'm going to play more of the fancy bowling. I like this one. This one's my favorite. This one will help. That's so why I just need to get a strike. I won't do that in one attempt, but I just like playing the game. I probably won't get it, but like... Still. This one I can at least show off cool ball maneuvers. Oh. I'm just trying to figure out how to like get a consistent strike. Hmm. Also, I did hydrate. Thank you for that, Kyrie. <laughs> Ugh. At least this game does a good job of making me want to punch a squee ball. Which squee ball is y'all's favorite, by the way? Do you guys have a favorite yet? <laughs> yeah, no, Stubby and Mau Mau, like, completely agreed. I'm partial to crab boom but uh if i'm going from like main cast probably like what the fuck happened to 
fangs right there. He's at an angle. Uh, I've always had a fondness for Octo. Just because a uh, little thing on their head looks like a heart. Already good. I feel, I feel like of all the uh, squeeballs, I feel the worst for Snorgle because he gets the short end of the, sh the stick. Like consistently. Like not only did he get put into a stew, oh god. Multiple times, he also got an entire minigame focused on just torturing him. Like, exclusively him. A vessel created for pain. What if I just found out who owns the rights to Squeeballs and just bought it from them someday? I, w I don't know why my first thought was just Squeeball's Mystery Dungeon, just because I think Kraboom would make like a fun little fantasy NPC. Like, at first you feel bad for these guys. And then you play, like, the Stampede game, and it's just... Legitimately, like, these games have, like, good controls. I'm just not good at them. Like, they're very tight motion controls. Crab Boom reminds me a bit of the rock uh, rock crabs in Sardi Valley. Yeah, I could kind of see that. Hell yeah! Uh oh, uh oh, no, 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 no. <sighs> Fine. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> See, like, you can't, like, hit it hard enough. I'm gonna lean back. Like, you have to do, like, an under- I'm trying to see if I can lean far enough back and do an underhand swing. He did. For whatever reason, I can only get him to go in this way. Woo! 
Why is it that Squeeballs has, like, tighter motion control than fucking, uh... Oh. Than fucking, uh... Wii Sports. Like, cause it feels like these are a lot more responsive. And, like, they actually lead with the controller. As if I can fucking use it right. Feels like this is almost made for left-handed people. Damn it, already. What? Like, can I swing? What am I- like, they're accurate, but like, they're fucking weird. Zeus, she's fucking dead. That's not gonna make it. <gasps> Stubby proved me wrong. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah! Fuck yeah! They're accurate, they just don't abide by the laws of physics. Yeah. It's five squeebells into the five point zone or beyond the score. Okay. Okay, okay. We made it for Stubby's failure. Oh, damn! Go, Boris! Why do I hear puppy? B oh, uh, cause my- if you hear barking, it's cause my dog is outside and, uh, the backyard is, like, directly outside of my window. Like, I'm on the second story, but, like, uh, unfortunately, my dog likes to bark. And, uh, there's not anything to help dampen her barking. So, yeah. Okay, we have one chance to hit a squeak ball. Damn. Damn it. Come on! One, go! Go, Stubby! Come on! Hell yeah! Blow up ten. Oh, not another one! What? <laughs> oh, oh, come on, Sushi. You were so close. Way to go, Boris. Goodbye, Boris.
<laughs> Mau Mau. Come on, come on. Yeah! Where'd he go? Oh, he's just, he's free. That stubby is free from this mortal plane. Oh! Damn, I thought I could have, like, tricked it to go, like... Come on, come on, come on, come on! Ah, damn. Ugh, fuck you. Come on, come on, come on! Ugh. Oh! Fuck you! Piece of shit. Come on. <laughs> He's been burnt to a crisp. <laughs> I just love when they're all- oh! Yike. Went a little far with that one, Meow Meow, sorry. <laughs> Goodbye, Artie. Oh! Damn it, uh. Damn. Damn it, Sushi. Octo! Ugh. Oh! Um! Did, did anyone see where Octo went? Did anyone see where Octo went? Hell yeah! Let's go, bully! I still don't know this guy's name, but he just exploded. Another excellent land! Hell yeah, Stubby! <laughs> we stand, Stubby! Oh, hell yeah! Snorkel survived! Oh, sushi. Is Fang gonna live? Yeah. Ah, damn. Hell yeah! 
snorkel with the last one! Did you just call sushi sussy? I love how uh, S Stubby landed all of his fucking hits and fucking S Octo belongs to the dirt now. Okay, this one I just have to hit the fuck out of him. Oh, my bad. Oh! Goodbye, Mau Mau! Damn! Oh, perfect landing! Hell yeah, Mau Mau! Another one? Oh, he's alive though, that's all that matters. Damn. Mau Mau is just lambing these! Sushi! Not Sushi! Uh, Octo! Fuck! Octo! Boris! Ah, Boris. Come on, Stubby! Ooh! He's dead, but he did it! Come on, Stubby! Number two! <laughs> He- he lived! Octo just fell into a sinkhole last time, yeah. He had enough squeeze balls in the correct color pens. Okay. This is the one where I don't- No! Oh crap, boom. Tell me! What? I'm this close to just hitting a crap boom and ending it all. Come on. Three, two, one, go. No. What? Well, fuck you. I'm slowly understanding it. I just need to. No. No. Hey! <laughs> 
I did it. I figured it out. <sighs> Ten speedball squeakballs without missing one. Whoa! 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 Let me try that again. Ow! I punched my microphone! Ow! Ow! I punched the mic! I punched the mic! Fuck you. I'm good. I'm I'm just hurting. <laughs> Which is the embodiment of I'm not good. <laughs> Feels like I'm death gripping my controller. A little bit. It's always the sushi. I smacked him though, fuck you. I I hit him though. Ah. Uh. I'm hitting him though. Why is my dog barking? Jesus. Your balls start to squee. <laughs> Mau Mau! Ah, hello, ah. Gordon Freeman. It's good to see you. Yo! Yo! <sighs> Let me look. Let me look. Uh, thank you, Edmay, for giving that sub to Rye. <laughs> Josh ain't even here. <laughs> Actually, currently, like, cause uh, the la like Josh has only given out one gift sub in the past month, so. Ah, uh, hello, Gordon Freeman. It's good to see you. <laughs> Josh is been given a run for their money. Fuck me running. Angry. Josh dethroned. Someone screenshot the top uh, gift subber and put it in the tweet. Discord, please. <laughs> Evil. <laughs> Unhinged. Be careful not to spend too much out of your uh, budget, though. It's like, like it's it's fun to have a little friendly competition. Just don't go overboard with it. <laughs> Thank you, Kyrie.
<laughs> Dude. Okay, man. I'm just I'm just m mentioning it. I've read some fix, man. I've seen some content. Not impossible. Just really difficult. <laughs> it's my stream. I can see what I want. Oh, uh, uh, Edme, if you got your Twitch hooked up to your Discord, you should be able to go into your Discord under connections and join through that. Just casual reminder to keep it clean in the actual channels because I do have some friends that are not okay with sex with like absurdly sexual jokes or like you know. uh Unhygienic humor, I think that's the best way to say it. <laughs> I need to make like proper list of rules, but I had bad history. Like a bad bit? Oh bit for Gordon. Take them friend. Thank you. Oh god, you triggered a hype train! How the fuck did you do that? Also, thank you, Al. How the fuck did you trigger a hype train? Jesus Christ! <laughs> y'all, y'all! I just had a pop up seeing a hype train in his clothes. What the fuck? Literally, someone has to give out one more thing, in like a minute. I think and it's gonna start off. If not, if it hasn't started already, Jesus criminy! What have you done, <laughs> gamers? What the fuck? Gamer! Nice train smiley face. <laughs> no! <laughs> you started it! Oh no! I can't focus on squee balls! <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> I've never had like enough people like rapid fire donate and sub, so I've never had a hype train before. And now, of all times, <laughs> when I'm playing Squeeball's party for the Wii. S Q U E E B A L L height train mid S E S S I O M. What did you do to my fucking text to speech there? I can't focus. <laughs> Thank you, gamers. It, it can't say squeeball. You have to separate into two words. And also, it's not squeeball, it's squeeballs. It's a species. Ow, I punched my microphone. I'm gonna stop playing this game. It hurts. I keep punching my microphone. Ow. I gotta stop. I, I can't play any more Squeeballs Cannon. I can't play the Cannon anymore. It hurts. <laughs> Squeephobic. Ah, I kept punching my mic and now everything hurts. Oh god. Ball. Sir. Ow. I've been going for almost four hours. My goal was to go for like four hours. So like I'm not complaining. Oh god, my hands. I keep punching the microphone. Oh. Have you guys ever had this thing, had this thing like happen where your hands get really cold and you know and like just any bump against them hurts your joints? It's cold in my room and I wear a tank top when I do uh very physically taxing streams so I don't like sweat through a t-shirt or whatever. So I'm like getting a little chilly and I keep punching my microphone and it's making my joints hurt like there's no tomorrow. Ow. Go get another soda, right? I need to- we're taking a, a brief respite. Oh, my hands, they feel like ice. Oh, pain.
God. I don't think we can keep playing it for like another th three hours. Like, like another two hours. I don't think there's enough content. I don't think I can get through this because like the game itself is acting up and I don't know what's happening. We've played every game. God, the fucking hype train thing is still up. I gotta get it off my chat. Give me a second. I gotta figure out how to disable- how to like- Because, uh, I have chat like pulled up into like a little window thing. Let me see if I can just- Because I'm trying- because I can't read chat because of the hype train notification. What? No one redeemed it, no swear? No one redeemed it, no s- Oh my god. I didn't see the no cussing because my stream. Okay. No, no, I, I, I noticed that now. That now. That. Look, okay, that doesn't count as like the start because I didn't see the notification. I, I, I'm, if I don't acknowledge it, like guys, like, I ha, I, I'm dealing with like my chat room being covered up by the hype train notification, and I've never had this problem before. So I, I haven't checked the uh, actual notification. So like. Yeah, no, no. I have to acknowledge the no cussing. Like, if I miss a no cussing, like, let me know. But in this case, I did not see it. I have- if I acknowledge the no cussing, then it's in effect. Just remembering that for the future. Pros and cons of hype dream. Pro, money, con, I can't see anything. I did an emo and didn't go- no! Like, did you use your point redeem? God. Like, uh, there's there's no emotes that you sh I can't save the game. <laughs> Why would you redeem a save your game? I can't save the game. Rai, I punched the microphone in your absence. God. Okay. Okay. I legitimately don't think I can play this game for another two hours. I just- It's not that I can't do it. I just don't think there's enough content for it. Like, cause- Uh. Like, Squeeball's testing. Like, this is- Like, handpicked isn't working right. I could play Squeeball Golf. Because I didn't show you guys Squeeball Golf. That's the one that we haven't done. We, we finished pumping. Feeding Frenzy, you've... Again, that's glitched out. Crazy Lanes. Where were we in this? Crazy Seconds. Yeah. You need great. We didn't finish Crazy Lanes. Oh yeah, because it glitched out and sent me back the cannon. Well, I'll do one more level of Crazy Lanes, then we'll go do golf. Golf has a- golf is weird. Oh, come on now. Oh god! Oh god! Uh One of my favorite jokes is like from a play it was like a playthrough of like a Chuck E. Cheese Wii game and uh one of the guys is just like golf He's Oh god It's like he's making a joke about like how the announcer said golf and all that. It's like Buck. What was the joke? Like, I forgot what the setup was for. Yeah, he just heard like the announcer say like golf, and he went like, "Flug, the g reverse golf, flug, the game where you beat the people with your club." Why can't I get this right? Did 
Beach off with your friends. What in this super monkey ball is this? I'm glad m multiple people have seen this as super monkey ball tonight. And again, legitimately, I was, like, before today, like, uh, last night, I was looking at, like, games, trying to figure out what ones I'd be interested in, like, playing, like, next year, because I have plans for this this month. And, uh, one of the games I was looking at was, a uh, Super Monkey Ball. Like, well, a Super Monkey Ball game, you know. Uh... Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, hell yeah, first try. Twenty gold stars and over and at least eight pins. Okay, we can do this. Oh god! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Goodbye! <laughs> Hell yeah. Ah, fuck, I forgot I need enough stars. Oh no! Oh, oh, I still got some though. I'll take it. Damn it. Come on, you. Damn it. So close. Try that again. Okay, okay, that's the pin requirement. Now I just need to get more stars. Damn it. No. <laughs> uh. I guess we just need to get every star. <laughs> okay, fair enough. Damn it. Uh, what? What? What happened to the ball there? Did it wrap around the pole? Whoa, 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 whoa. I was joking. I was joking. I don't want to be here. I was just trying to get an easy out. Uh, okay. That's, uh, that's like another thing. There's a lot of games that you could play with the squee balls, you know, like baseball. Like you could uh, add baseball, probably even basketball, you know? Whack-a-mole. Thank you. 
Black Bull's one I'm surprised they didn't think to go with in the first place, you know, like. Click four stars and score a strike with one throw. Ugh. Okay. This one looks messy. Uh-oh. Nope. Yeah, yeah, that was when we... Sunglasses on him? <laughs> you did! Hell yeah! <laughs> uh, same here, I haven't seen any of like Wayne Radio TV stuff. Like with the gnome. Damn it. I want to know how I get that. I think I just need to go slower. Can I just go slower? Oh yeah. Damn it. We know the trick though. Collect two stars and knock over the split pins in 20 seconds with one throw. Um, that is a lot to ask. I thought the last one was asking a lot, but okay. Damn it. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay, trying that again. I do love the idea of a bowling ball, uh, like, platformer, though. I mentioned that earlier in the stream, and I, it's it remains. Like, I know there's a lot of, like, uh, like, like, games where you play as a marble and try to navigate the world, but, like, honestly, bowling. Fuck you too, I guess. Marble but violent. There's actually a game that was like, uh... There's a game that was like unlisted. I think it was like a remake of Marble Madness. 
Damn it. I did this before. Why aren't you letting me do it now? Okay, at least I know how to, like, get the pins down now. Come on, you. No! Oh, Because there are Marvel platformers that are, like, incredibly difficult because they have ball physics, but, like... I think this game has decent ball physics. Hell yeah! Oh, they just keep going. Score a strike and all 25 stars do the rest of the ball. Ah! I'm gonna die. I'm just gonna cease to exist. What do you mean you want to strike in two shots, but you're not letting me use the second ball? What? What am I doing wrong? You're telling me I can throw two balls, just reset the pins. Okay. 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 <sighs> yeah, that's what I'm guessing too. No! God damn it! Oh. 
What? Oh, anger. Oh, only half half power. Oh. I'm trying to calm down. I am a stressing. Get into the lava. <laughs> I missed the star. Just restart the whole run. If you listen carefully at the beginning, you can hear the squee balls in fear. I hate this. I hate this. Tell- I'm looking- I'm gonna see if I've cleared this. I don't think I have, but... I haven't. Oh. Okay, okay, let's try golf. Let's try golf. Let's do golf. I didn't show you guys golf. Let's do golf. This one's focused on Octo. Damn, a bit too far. Oh, too too shallow. Sorry, Octo. <laughs> Again, I need to. I need. I forget that there's like a little indicator on the ground. Jesus Christ. I'm not doing Octo any favors, am I? 
Yeah, it's a whole ass trebuchet. I would love if there was like a normal Squeak Balls golf though. One. Ah. Oh. I forgot I had to like flick him upwards. Oh, come on. I didn't hit B in time. Two. Three. Four. Five. He's <laughs> sinking. Yeah. Yeah, we're just skipping him like a rock and... No, 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 I hit the wrong button. I hit the wrong button. No, I'm not going back. Nope, nope, no, 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 no. No, I refuse. Throck, no, a minimum of 200 yards catch a dry landing of the light breeze blowing. Okay, the goal's over there. Damn it. Did it count? Hell yeah. <laughs> it's not a dry landing, but he sure is traumatized. Oh no! Oh no! He's gonna crash! Oh! He did more than crash, but... Uh oh! Release loops a little too early! No! So close. <laughs> Goodbye, Octo! No, Octo! Stop! Stop! Ooh. Might have... Might have thrown a bit too hard. No. 
Goodbye, Octo. I can't even get him to turn. Goodbye! Oh! Um! You saw him just floating in midair, right? Not just me? No, Octo! I, I'm flicking him to the right, though. What? What? I hit the thing. No! Okay, that time I didn't miss time it. And yes, I did turn him into pink goo. I like to imagine he just, like the color he turns into just melted strawberry ice cream. Did he do it? Yeah! Throw Octo 150 yards on the dry land with strong wind. No! Octo! Goodbye! He's free! His o o o noise sounds like that vine of the girl going, Here's my impression of Shakira washing her hands at the foot. It's too hot. I've never seen that. I. Die. Go out of bounds. Goodbye. My son is dead. And stop. He hit a tree, but it counts. Yeah, yeah, go right ahead. Throw Octo a minimum of 300 yards and bounce it three times to reach dry land with a minimum win. Oh no. Didn't count. Damn it. Damn, four hours. I released B too soon. Damn it. <laughs> oh, oh, he's shaking. He's a shaking. One, 
two, three, and he sticks the- oh! They didn't even show his body. That's locked up twice on the water before landing on the snow platform. Beware of the strong crosswind. Farewell. That poor fucking octobus. <laughs> what? Thought I hit it in time, I did not. I guess if he dies, it doesn't- Oh, he's gonna hit that rock. He's gonna hit that rock. It's- Oh! God, that sound was awful, but he did it. <laughs> Fair enough. Oh god, not the Isles of Man. I hate this one. Look at that. We're in- Look at that. This one took me fucking hours to clear. Goodbye, Octo. Isle of Sand. It is man. That implies that, like, humans exist to some degree to squeeballs. Either that or they've lived blissfully ignorant until we've invaded their home. No! 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 Fuck! Man. Don't splat, don't splat! Fuck! Don't splat! Fuck! No! 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 Octo! Fuck! Land! Don't hit it! Don't hit it! Don't hit it! Okay. What? I have two throws? Oh, wait. I understand the mistake. My bad. Don't splat. Don't splat. Don't you dare. Mm, Octo. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Die. Fucked up that almost worked. <laughs> Goodbye, Octo. Whoa, 
At this point, I'm just being mean. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I fucked up. Go faster! Go faster! Ow! The worst part is, the faster you go, the faster he goes, obviously. But, like, you have to... You have to do it in big circles with your arms. Like, the circles have to get bigger and bigger, or else they don't register... Ow. It hurt. Stop, stop, no. <laughs> he just did the man meme. He just stopped to look down into the water like, man. <laughs> Don't move? Oh, perfect! See, he just faced away like, man. He just keeps doing it. I wonder. I wonder why. Uh oh, coming into your pot. <gasps> what the fuck? If he would have landed that, <laughs> I'm just in something. No, I was trying to re-angle my shot. If you listen to his voice, it gets deeper when he slows down. Like, listen. Come on, you could have stopped on that. My arm is hurting. Oh, my God. 
Where's my drink? I got another hydrate redeemed. Good God. My hands, they are cramping. Oh. So help. Shut up. Shut up. I can't listen to your weird moans. So how we vibing? How we doing? I'm sweaty. Like, my hands are cramping. <laughs> How's everyone else holding up? I'm like, I'm, I'm gonna try to warm up my hands a little bit so hopefully they'll stop hurting. You enjoying the game? I've played so much and I'm so tired. I legitimately thought I reset my save though, so like, I'm surprised. Like, I went through, I looked up how to delete save data and everything. I guess they just didn't wipe. Let's do it. Hell yeah, art. I love I love this hell so much. This is I oh uh, yeah, my history with this game. Again, my little cousin had this when we were like when she was really little. Like when I I want to say this game came out like early wee days, so like oh, I don't even know. Actually, uh I have found people posted reviews of Squeeballs. But like, what? Okay, I just looked up Squeeball's party on a uh, wiki, and what it gives me is Squeeball's is the world's fun cross-platform party game avail available for Nintendo Wii, Nintendo DS, and as an iPhone application. Somewhere in the Pacific, Squeeballs.com joined April. 2009 and it links to a twitter account <laughs> you can't tell me there's a twitter for this no load i want to there's a squeeballs twitter there's a squeeballs twitter it's like hey <laughs> and their <laughs> and their most recent tweet was from december 14th 2010 that says hey at squeeballs followers we are moving to a new twitter account follow the company at uh, pdp gaming gamer what the sh yeah they literally a bunch of their more recent tweets are just like hey we're moving accounts oh god one of the links they give us for a tumblr blog oh no this is an ancient relic of a bygone era. What if I just added PDP gaming and just be like, hey, we're when Squeeballs 2 coming out? Because last time I checked, PDP was like, they made gaming like accessories, like headphones and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Play PDP. We make officially licensed headset controllers and gaming accessories. Where's your video games? Give them to me. I'm gonna look up PDP gaming. Like. I, I want to see what other games they've made. I don't care about their... I don't care about their... Like, their equipment. I care about their games. What are the Squeepals party reviews? 
I want to see what people have said about squee balls. Because people pee. <laughs> You're PvP gaming when Gordon fucking gets you. Yeah. I see a couple long plays. So. It's not dead. We know that much. Yeah, there's a Metacritic and an Instructoid review. What does Metacritic have to say about this game? Metacritic does not rate party games high, ever. Yeah, okay. The meta score was like 59, but the user score was a 7.8 out of 10, so... Come on, come on. I wanna... I wanna read the description. Uh, Squeeballs are small creatures manufactured on a secret island... My controller's fine. Squeeballs are small creatures manufactured on a secret island somewhere in the Pacific Ocean. Before they can be sold as to children as toys around the world, squeeballs must be fully tested, to the point of destruction. That's where the player comes in. They blow up, slice, smack, punch, bowl, shoot, and, sk and skim the squeeballs through 11 main game challenges. A developer performance design products. Publisher performance design products. Genre miscellaneous. Puzzle, puzzle, party, party slash minigame in general. Rating E10. Does the official Squeeballs website still work? No, it doesn't. But it's on sale for $2,000. I don't care about Squeeballs enough to own the Squeeballs domain. Yeah, a lot of these are like pretty high reviews. Yeah, one of the reviews just says, like, the only reason you want to play this game is for the squeeballs themselves and not the actual gameplay. And I agree with that. And, like, a bunch of people are just saying, like, yeah, it's a good game. And, like, we like the characters. We just don't like how broken the game is and how repetitive. And I can agree with that. I can agree with that. Again, like, the squeeballs have potential. I want to see how much it would cost to buy the copyright from them. Like, I don't care about anything else uh, PDP does. I just want the Squeeball shit. Like, they're not using it. Give it to me. God, if I was well off, I would buy it. <laughs> like, no, that's completely valid, man. I just want to see how much it would cost to actually buy the Squeeball's copyright. You know? they ha Clearly, they've only made one game back in, like, 2009. So, it's been almost like it's been like 12 years i think they can afford to get rid of it they have not made anything in 12 years just give me the copyright and give me what you've made for it i just want to see what they have because clearly they're never going to talk about this thing again the day i get big like let it be said now the day i get big enough i'm going to go and buy the squeeballs copyright because clearly no one else wants it. Can you like look up who owns what copyright? Is that a thing you can do? I I'm looking up how to look up who has a copyright. Like who owns like copyrights and all that. Yeah, how to find out who owns the copyright. Uh, it's like, just just give me the rights to Squeeballs, I swear. Oh, there is a way to search online. Can, can I find, please? Please? Let me in? One. 
not public. Either that or they just publish it in another country. But I can't find anything for Squeeballs. PvP, PvP just give me your game. Angry. Angry. I... <laughs> There's a lot of games out there that are interesting, you know. But like most, in like, you know, that one I could see people wanting to copyright to. But like a lot of the games I think about are like indie games and I don't want those to be copywritten. I just... Like, obviously, I want the creators to have their shit. But, like, I don't want the copyright to those, you know? I want the copyright to Squeeballs. Gimme. <laughs> I'll make more Squeeballs. I'll release these fucked up little cretins on, like, an unsuspecting mass. Like, could you imagine a Squee... Like, I really want to make, like, a f like little jokey Squeeballs RPG. I think that would be, like, most fitting for them. Like, like, hear me out. Like, I think these creatures are interesting and funny enough that they would fit really well in, like, an RPG setting or, like, in just an, an adventure game kind of thing. I think having, like, a set of creatures that, like, live to be destroyed could be a really interesting premise. Like, having certain things that can only be, like, done by certain squeeballs. You know, and a lot of those things end up in, like, death. <laughs> Like, first thing that came to mind is, like, a squeeball squeezing into, like, a smaller, like, crevice to grab something. But, like, that crevice is, like, in a cave that is being, that is, like, full of toxic air. Or, like, even more simply, just, like, taking Kraboom and just throwing him at a wall. Or, like, releasing Bully on, like, a random enemy to, like, distract them. There's a lot of potential with these guys. <laughs> Ugh. I'm going for like four and a half hours. My arms are hurting. Ugh. Hey, I said it. Okay, I was telling myself I wanted to go at least four hours on this, you know. I wasn't sure if I could squeeze out a full six. Just because, like, this game doesn't have a lot going for it and I have played it so many times that like I don't have much of a curve to figure out how to do things like obviously if you're just finding this game now oh actually let me check my high scores let's see if there's like anything else I don't want to do Isle of Man let's, let's see if there's anything else total squeeballs texted 7,000 Jesus. Uh, electrocuted 94, exploded 988, eaten 751, bowled over 1600, sliced 119, hit 534, frozen 376, rolled up 137, squashed 114. Oh, there's more. Fuzz. Oh, wait, they have their names here? Okay, we got Boris, which is the squid. Bully's the little blue dog. Uh, Mau Mau's the green cat. Octo is, you know, octopus. Sushi's the fish. Fuzzy. Or like Fuzz. He's, his name is Fuzz? The little brown guy's name is Fuzz? Yeah, because then we got Stubby, Fang, Artie, Snorkel, and Kraboom. It's a lot of crabooms. What is a like okay, what is a party game? Okay, it's just like we're in a few random games, okay. Why would you want to play this instead of the challenge ladders, though? I'm gonna bet that these are just the challenge ladder games, but like... Hmm. Yeah, because it looks like I have everything unlocked. Yeah, like, s at the end of the day, Squeeballs is a party. It's called Squeeballs Party for a reason, you know? Look, 
like party game how many players yeah you can have like four players which like m makes sense play easy six of the best getting tough figure of eight stacking it up penultimate event the whole lot play all 11 games interesting you can do little custom setups okay interesting once once it gets safer to travel I'm gonna play fucking squeeze balls with people ugh See, I like, because frankly, I feel like my parents would sooner kill the squee balls than play this game. Okay, I'm gonna bring this up, like, because <laughs> I like, I I've had this, I've had like one version of this discussion with people before, but I kind of want to bring, I want to like suggest this. Okay, what's what do you find more annoying, the minions or the rabbits? I also I was going I'm thinking also like th like like minions versus rabbits versus squee balls like who would win ultimately I think probably the rabbits would because the squee balls are made to be killed and the minions are kind of stupid like worse off than the rabbits like like let's start an argument who would win in a fight a minion or a rabbit but I'm I'm th I, I th whenever I think about squee balls I think of like dumb little like video game and cartoon characters and I immediately think of the rabbits which makes me think of the minions like I, I know there's people still hanging out here G give me an argument minions cannot die what is your source <laughs> what is your source <laughs> yes I from what we've seen they can't age but like no 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 from what we've seen they can't age but like in the movie, they don't age, obviously, because like they're the same, like they're in the same form and all that throughout their whole lives. But who's saying they can't die? Like, who's saying a minion could not have been eaten? You know? Like, there is no kid in evidence that a minion or a rabbit has died. So. Like, they can both die. Like, there's no evidence to support they're immortal, but there's no evidence to su Well, actually, no. Minions have, like, a little bit of evidence to show they're, they're most likely, like, ageless beings. But it doesn't prove that they can't die. Like, a, like a Dracula can live forever, but, like, it, it's still killable. I was just sent to Google and said, can minions, and the first out of it was, can minions die? What's the answer? What's the, what does Google say? What is Google's opinion on the, de on like how a minion, on if a minion can cease living? Is th I know there's evidence to support that they're ageless and that they're like kind of like, you know, they just don't die. They can't die of old age, at least from what we've seen, but like, bruh. Bruh, I need to know, can- Like, I don't think they're indestructible. I really don't. I- I'm pretty sure you could just, like, fucking kill one. If you really wanted to. Obviously, they're not gonna kill him on screen, because it's a fucking kid series, but, like... Still. Ray, Ray, I have complete faith in you to kill a minion. <laughs> kill them on screen, Jesus. Powerful sentence. Just do you try to hang them once didn't work. Yeah, they don't have necks. 
Their body is a singular pill shape. There's no neck bone. Like, you can't hang something that doesn't have a neck. Like, there's instances of them trying to kill him, but they always go through, like, the methods of, like, how to kill a human. It's it's kind of confirmed that, like, minions are not human. A, a screenwriter for Despicable Me confirmed they can't die? What? No fucking way. No fucking way. Okay, okay, actually, if I stop and think about it, like, okay, minions being immortal, that makes sense, because, like, all minions are male, so they can't procreate, because it's canonic, it's, like, canon that female minions don't exist, and they could never exist, because, uh, minions can't fuck. And God forbid, the day I see a baby minion is the day I burn down this whole godforsaken internet. The minions are unfuckable. They shouldn't be allowed. I s like considering the fact that there are no female minions, and it's confirmed that all the minions are male, and not like genderless. Then that highly like would suggest that the minions cannot like cannot procreate. But God forbid, if there's like ever a movie where like they bring out a baby minion, I'm gonna just start violence. So much violence. Like, just, just unrelenting. Yeah, yeah, like, I feel like, I feel like the way that, uh, okay, honestly, maybe my controller disconnecting is for the best, because I don't want to get flagged for music. But like, uh, what was I saying? Um, I, I feel like the past couple of years, especially like, God, it feels like 2016. I don't know why it always feels like 2016 when I think about like the baby nut fiasco with like planters and just like the baby versions of like every, like I just a bunch of famous characters and it's like, who, who would want this? It would be one thing. If it was like, okay, like, if I were to, if you had asked me, hey, you have to, like, uh, one of these, like, famous characters from your childhood has to be a child now, which one is it gonna be? I would go with, like, an animal character before I went with, like, an object or a person, you know? Like, any, uh, uh, the fuck, Yoda, Yoda is, like, too humanoid. It makes me uncomfortable seeing like the ch like the child apparently it's called. I do not like seeing baby Yoda. Like it it's a fine design, but just like I don't like it. Like the only reason I don't like it is because it's a babied version of Yoda. Like Ugh. Like yeah, your first thought would go to animals cuz baby animals are cute. There's like some interest there. But going with like a baby version of like a grown adult character that's like a human or like incredibly humanoid like non-anthro I mean it would just be weird like I'd sooner prefer seeing like a baby version of like the Trix rabbit before I saw fucking hell I don't know the Monopoly man you know I'd sooner see like a baby rabbit than an actual baby human Boss Baby got- t Boss Baby turned into an adult, like, in, like, the second Boss Baby movie, and I was like, okay, it's going in a good direction already from what I was seeing from the ads, but then he gets babyfied again, it's like, I don't want to watch it. I didn't- I didn't see the first one, and I have no interest in watching the thing. I just love looking at it and just going, like, I don't want to watch it. 
I've never seen Boss Baby. I feel like I feel like that movie would be more of like a drunken high at like 4 a.m. kind of thing with you and your friends after a party where you're just too numb to change the channel. Never seen the second one. Oh god. Yeah. I need someone- I don't care enough about the first one. I just see the boss baby and I'm like, you are a meme. I care not for your existence. Like... It- it- it's so much. It- it's so much. Oh, I forgot there was a Boss Baby TV series! Also, I think your brother is too old for the Boss Baby TV series. I think that was made for small children. And, like, continuing the whole, like, I don't like baby versions of, main, of like, uh, like characters and all that, like, human characters. Just uh, total drama-rama. Like, I have- okay- me and my buddy Critter, like, Critter's working, like, a full-time job right now, so it's hard to schedule, but we were planning on doing, like, an entire podcast just talking about, uh, Total Drama Island. Like, the entire series from the start. And just going through it, like, season by season. Seen the actual first movie, and yeah, I confirm it's something. <laughs> You'd watch it at 2 a.m. I remember watching it with my family, but I don't remember what He still likes Minions. Okay, like, Minions, I don't hate Minions. I think Despicable Me is a fine movie. I th think the Minions is a fine movie, you know? It's, like, something that, like, if I don't have anything better to put on, I'll turn on. But, like, if I have a, a better option, you know? It's something you put on for, like, background noise. It's not something that I would actively, like, seek out, you know? Yeah, Despicable Me was fucking great, you know? I've never saw the third one. The second one was so-so. It wasn't bad. The first one I've seen it a bit too many times. But I, 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 I kind of want to watch the third one just because it looks like a train wreck. Because they like have this whole thing with Gru having a twin brother. Yeah, yeah, like, I feel like Despicable Me... If it, I feel like the first one would have been fine, but then people got really attached to the minions, and that was the end of it. Here, I, I think we're done with the game for tonight. Like, <laughs> he's got hair. His name was Drew. I forgot his name was Drew. Here, uh, let me s swap back because, like, we're not. I'm not really playing the game anymore. So, like. Let me change the category now. Yeah, the first one was good. It was serviceable. Like. I don't want to think about this pick from before. I remember there was they were trying to make like a Shrek five or whatever. Yeah, like I remember like a few years back, like when the Shrek meme was really starting to kick off again, and like a bunch of rumors were going around, like oh they're they're gonna make a new Shrek film. Oh, yeah, yeah, The Rise of Gru. I remember hearing about that. Like, I would like to see... Con okay, like, Gru, like, little kid Gru. I feel like that's a fine enough difference. Like, it's not a baby version of him. It's a kid, but, like, it's a kid that's, like, old enough to have some kind of personality, you know? It's not just a baby version of Gru for the sake of having a baby version of Gru. I feel like if you're going to tell the story of, like, a character... Having it start off when they're, like, ten years old isn't a bad spot. Because by then they have, like, at least one or two hobbies they're passionate about, you know? Starting it off at, like, age three. I'm never- I'm- or, like, lower. I fucking hate baby versions. <laughs> Let me sketch, but my screenshot until totally late working. Oh no, good luck, Cry. Childhood and there's no minions. Actually, no, because in the Minions movie, uh- it showed him, like, meeting them at the same age that he would be in, like, The Rise of Gru. So, like, we'll have a little bit of time with no minions, but they'll probably show up. 
I would like to see how, like, Gru takes to them and vice versa, you know? Because, like, honestly, Gru's kept them around this many years for a reason, you know? It's, like, shown in the first movie that he's not too fond of, like, overly, like, excitable things because it gives him a headache. But it, it, there's got to be something behind the minions that has him keep them around. Well, yeah, the Minions movie is a prequel. At the end of the Minions movie, they meet Gru, and he's a little kid. Ray! I understand not liking Minions, but the Minions movie was decent. It was serviceable. It, like, yeah, yeah, at the very end of the Minions movie, young Gru shows up. No, no, it's a prequel. Yeah. <laughs> Oh god, today's today I will mark today in history is the day that Ray found out the Minions movie was a prequel to Despicable Me. <laughs> Dude, seriously, if you go and just like if if you find if I'm sure Despicable Me like uh the Minions movies on any like stream I cannot play it here. I don't want to get flagged. But no, if you go and look at the very end, like before the credits, literally the last five minutes Gru shows up. And, like, steals from the, like, Scarlet Overkill. And then the minions are like, oh, he's more evil. Let's go follow him. <laughs> Cry my eyes out. Look what you've done. I don't want to. I don't want to look. Right, I'm going to DM you a screenshot of the part of the wiki page. Get his ass. <laughs> no. Bug. Bug. Move quickly. Move quickly. Bug. Move quick. Get that screenshot to him. Holy shit. Get his ass. Get his ass. Holy shit. Open it, open it, open it. <laughs> you have to, you gotta, you have, it's like opening Pandora's box. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> I know that TNG can see where it is. <laughs> Holy fuck. Holy fuck. I'll put it in the Twitch Discord too. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Holy shit. I'm crying. <sighs> Thank you, Bug. Thank you, Bug. Oh. Oh. <laughs> That's cool. Uh, Ed May like added me in like another server with like arts of a cross between crab booms and head crabs. Hell yeah. Oh, I need to let Ed May in. Shit. <laughs> I'm looking at chat and I see Josh has, ex has welcomed the competition. There are two Despicable Me prequels. <laughs> Lying on the floor in a pool of tears of fucking death. Is that your birthday? What? What birthday, huh? Wait. 
Wait, what do you mean? What do you mean? <gasps> oh no! Oh no! Ray's birthday is the cries of Gru! Ray! <laughs> Reagan! <gasps> oh my god! I'm bootlegging it! I'm bootlegging it and I'm playing it in the call! <gasps> Holy shit! <gasps> Holy shit! Ray! I'm holding you so tight right now! Holy fuck! A fate worse than death! Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Ray. I'm sorry, I'll be quiet. Good night, guys. <sighs> sorry, my dad just popped his head in. No, I want to... I want to see what birthdays. I want to see what movies came out on my birthday now. I'm gonna go drink some water. My throat is dry from laughing too much. I'm dead. <laughs> Hell yeah. birthday tomorrow happy early birthday you're not oh okay Ray fair enough mean to Kyrie Just boss baby family business came out of my birthday. Oh no! Oh no! You are being beaten to death. You are being beaten to death. Oh, holy shit. Holy fuck. You're so cursed. You have a hex on you. Holy fuck. Ray, Ray. I'm so sorry, Ray. I'm trying to find if there was like any movies that were released on like my birthday. I think the Tron movie like a bunch of years back was on my birthday. <laughs> I can see the <laughs> No it's not, motherfucker, come here. You you cannot grass on him into the line. <laughs> so dramatic. <laughs> so, fucking fucking actor fucking drama student. He is though. He is. He's in he's in an acting course. <laughs> it's also like four AM for him right now, so he's probably suffering from lack of sleep. What? <laughs> what? Airplane and men in black. Never mind I'm back. What? I'm lightheaded. <laughs> oh, oh, that's what you were thinking. Okay, I was very confused. Ooh. Ooh, I'm crying.
Weekly Blunt 2. Oh, yeah, I only saw the first one. I'm just having a time. My birthday has like no popular movies on it. Fair enough, fair enough. I think you're better off without that. Want some, want some I'll trade. <laughs> it's not it's not trading if there's nothing there. It's just giving away. Jesus Christ. Okay, I think the stream's over now. We went on for a little over five hours. I think this is a good spot to end it. Holy shit. Wait, wait, I've got Christopher Robin Elmer to trade it for the rise of crew. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's end of stream, end of stream. <laughs> good night, everyone. I will, I'll see some of you later. Everyone else, good night. Have a good evening. I'm <laughs> Kupapa, I'm gonna go close stream before I lose my fucking mind any further. Oh god. Thanks for hanging out with me today. I love this game. I just- it just sucks that I couldn't get- I couldn't go as far as like I wanted to. That fucking sucks, but eh, I- I couldn't do anything about that. Anyways, see y'all later. Have a good night. Yeah, thanks for that, but- I'm glad you guys enjoyed the stream. Okay. See y'all later.